So, hello, I am Emmanuel Maef. I am dermatologist in France, and it's a great pleasure for me to talk about tattooing in psoriasis patients. I have some disclosures. The question is, can a patient with psoriasis be tattooed? It's a frequent question we have during consultation for psoriasis, for other skin disease, chronic skin disease, such as atopic dermatitis, for example. Uh, and the other question is, I have a systemic treatment, immunosuppressive treatment. Can I uh, get a tattoo? Uh, you know that tattoo is very uh, frequent in Western countries. It's increasing about 20% of patients have tattoos. So it's a, a, real problem during, a real problem during our consultations. And when we read the literature, it's no unknown. We cannot tattoo uh, patients with active psoriasis and we cannot tattoo uh, patients re receiving immunosuppressive therapies. So what can we say to our patients? We performed two studies to respond to this uh, daily problem. The, the, the two studies were named tattoo, it's not regional, I'm sorry. The first was the, the evaluations of patients and we evaluated the frequency of complications in patients with psoriasis. And we evaluate in a second study the dermatologist's knowledge, attitudes, and practice in an international study in France, Italy, in, and Finland. So, what was tattoo? One, the, the methodology was very simple. It was a multi center cross sectional observational study performing 23 dermatology centers in France. And we include all the patients with psoriasis, with or without tattoos. It was re realized in 2018, and the main outcome was to evaluate the prevalence of type of complications associated with tattoos in these patients. We included more than 2,000 patients, and you see that 20% of them were tattooed, and they have about two or three tattoos per, per patient. It was not always, the two tattoos were not performed at the same time, so it was very interesting to evaluate. And, uh, you see the profiles of the patients and the, the main criteria associated to a tattoo was the age of the patients. The more younger, the more young the patients were, the, the more, more the frequency was high for the tattoo. First, we evaluated patients without tattoos and we asked, have you ever wanted a tattoo? And finally, it's a, a, a major surprise, 15% of patients said, yes, I wanted to have a tattoo. And in half of the case, it was not performed because of psoriasis of the treatment of the physician. Uh, so on finally, 5% will, they say that will, they will have a tattoo. When we look at the tattooed patients, you see there is three, three groups. The tattoo before the psoriasis onset, the tattoo after psoriasis onset, without treatment or with treatment when the patient were, were, was tattooed. And <clears throat> we only find local complications, transient local complications such as edema, isolated pruritis, etc. etc. And it was a little bit more frequent in patients with psoriasis and in patients with treatments, but we did not identify any systemic complications, any severe uh, complications of, such as sarcoidosis, for example. Uh, we had some flares after uh, tattooing, cutaneous uh, flares uh, mainly. Three patients described psoriasis arthritis. Was it a flare of the arthritis? Was it a, a tattoo induced flares? We don't know exactly, exactly. Lots of patients, about uh, 20 or th from 20 to 30 patients, declared to have uh, psoriasis plaque within the tattoo. Uh, and some declared that the tattoo was spared by psoriasis. When we look at the treatment, the impact of the treatment of the frequency of uh, complications, you see that when we have systemic treatments and biologics, there were, there were more frequently local complications, but we all can also can say that it was more severe psoriasis. Uh, but the, the other com there was no uh, other com severe complications in the patients. Uh, here are examples of uh, uh, 
patients with plaque, psoriasis, and tattoo on the left, uh, uh, beautiful common phenomenon in the red tattoo, but also in the black tattoo, and on the uh, right, the right, uh, the, the left of the slide, sorry, as you have plaque of psoriasis, but without, without Kemner phenomenon. The second study evaluated the, what do finally dermatologists think about tattooing in psoriasis on, uh, in uh, patients with systemic treatments. You see the, the, the profiles of the uh, 468 dermatologists. I, I don't describe even the, the difference between the, the countries. Uh, what was important in this slide, it's that only 6% of dermatologists are tattooed, so quite less frequently than the general population. Populations. 54 patient, 52 patients at, are unfavorable, have an unfavorable opinion about tattooing, and you see, and more than 50 of them declare to have had questions about tattooing uh, in psoriatic patients, but only 23% have found complications of tattoos in psoriatic patients. So it's, it was not finally so frequent. And when we ask, the opinion of the, about the possibility of making a permanent tattoo, you see the high frequency of opposition of all the dermatologists, whatever the conditions. When there is an active psoriasis, more than 80% declare uh, that they are, they, they, they are opposed to the, the tattooing, but whatever the, the, the the status of psoriasis, which was the treatment, topical phototherapies, or systemic treatments, more than 50% are opposed to tattooing in this population. So I was different. Well, I saw you only one uh, table here uh, about the question uh, in patients with psoriasis in complete clearance. We look for the reason for the reluctance about tattooing in the, the dermatology population, dermatologist population, and the only the only item we found for all the questions, it was the, op the own opinion about tattooing. Not, uh, we find the same for tattooed patients and non-tattooed patients, but it was the only reason finally for this reluctance uh, about tattooing. So the conclusions are, when we have the questions, can I get a tattoo if I have a psoriasis with a systemic treatment such as, such as mesotrexate or biologics, we know that we are reluctant in general, uh, but it's only our own opinion about tattooing and not evidence-based medicine. So we can say, yes, you can tattoo. The, there are minor side effects, easily controlled by topical treatments, and there is no danger in getting a tattoo if the patient has psoriasis. I, I don't say active or not active psoriasis. If we have psoriasis in the scalp, you can tattoo on the trunk. It's not a problem for me. And, but we also can tattoo if we have an immunosuppressive therapies. Uh, of course, we can say that maybe you can avoid to have the tattoo on an active plaque. Uh, of course, also, it is important to follow good tattooing practice. Probably that we have no complications because in France, the, the regulations is quite hard about tattooing. Thank you. Here are the references.